So the Chrisleys, their family had a reality show. What was the name of the show, Lunchbox? Calling the Chrisleys. Chrisleys knows best. Got it. And we got to know them a little bit. Todd Chrisley, whenever Lunchbox went out for a while, Todd Chrisley came and sat in and was a co-host on the show. Right here. <laughs> and I never did anything with him that was, you know, just hanging out. But I liked him. Yeah, he's really nice. Yeah, I mean, he's super nice. I like being around him. Uh, it was all professional, nothing personal. He goes to jail. We're like, let's go to jail and visit him. Lunchbox writes him a letter. Yeah. And you did send it. Send it. Send what? it from two different post offices. That way, you know. Then, you sent the letter twice? Yeah. You copy it or did you read, write it twice? No, I just printed it twice. Oh, it, it wasn't all handwritten. Got yeah, it, yeah. The it, reason it. was my handwriting's bad. Got it. And B, I was worried, you know, how you hear about the stories in the movies where the mailman's satchel gets a hole in it and it falls out and they never get the letter. It's a terrible story in a movie. I've, I've never, never seen that movie, but what that. a plot. Yeah. And so I or said, okay, yeah. I'm going to go to two different post offices and I'm going to give it to two different people. That way it has two different avenues to get there. Okay, and then... Is there an update? We have not heard anything from him. Okay. And I thought, oh, he never wants me to visit. Well, turns out the warden is stealing his mail. His or the whole, like, specifically him? Yes, because his his daughter, she posted on Instagram this whole long thing about how the warden is not being nice to the, her dad. And They're really called wardens? I always thought that was like yeah. a 60s. No, man, that's their title. I know, but the, it's still the warden. Warden? Or is it like executive in charge of the facility prison? No, it's warden. That's awesome. Yeah. yeah. And so I was like, what? And I start reading it. And it says, yeah. And we won't even talk about how you're. he's taking his mail. So no. you don't know for sure. And is she? does she know for sure or is she just speculating stuff to get in the on the inter, like internet? Well, that's what, I mean, how would I, I? I've never been to the jail. I haven't seen what's going on. But I'm she saying, did she, had, did she have proof? Or did she just say? Uh, I mean, I can read the letter to you. If you would like, I mean, and you can decide for yourself uh, what is going on. I don't know. <laughs> and but you're convinced this is why you haven't heard back from him. This is the warden. Why, yes, for sure. Because it says, I am nervous for you, Father. Our warden is absolutely insane. We'll stop at nothing to stop leaks that keep exposing her sick lies. Oh, it's a girl. Didn't realize that. The warden's a girl? Yeah. Ooh. The warden's yeah. lying? Yeah. According to this. Go ahead. They stole... Uh, dad's mail and destroyed it but what the warden did yesterday has gone completely overboard and i would not be surprised if she's getting if she's plotting against your dad I, I, you dad i, I don't Who, know that's who's the letter written to i don't understand I don't a know. lot of tenses going on it there. seems like a note she's this is, putting on instagram no, this right? is a note that someone sent her like that someone sent her and she's posting it saying the mail has been stolen the warden is out to get your dad like and so she's putting it out there so we know that her dad is being unfairly treated. So that makes me believe he never got our mail. But here's the deal. From all the movies I've seen, prison movies, the warden can do whatever they want. Carte blanche. Like, whatever. Yeah, like, it's he, warden. you're in prison. You have no rights. So whatever the warden lets you have. That's the right. That's the right. Mm -hmm. So, well, okay, then that, what I would say is then wait for a new warden and send another one. Yeah, or we just say in the letter, hey, warden, what? Warden, I know you're reading this, warden. <laughs> yes, <laughs> would you please, would you please not this destroy to... this one? Okay, then let's do that. Okay. So I'll... send the letter again. I'll write a new one. P.S. Dear warden. Oh, my yeah. gosh. I know you're reading this. Please don't take this one. Yeah, please don't destroy this one. Should you write that on the on the, on the envelope? No, because they'll read it. I don't think they throw mail into the fire straight away. Okay. Well, maybe. It sounds like this one she's not. I don't know. But yeah, you're right. She probably read definitely it. address the warden. I will. Next thing you know, lunchbox is down there visiting up. We're ready to go now. What if he addresses one to the warden? Yeah. Only right. a letter yes. to the warden. Yep. Yes. Oh, yep. now we're talking. Yep. So do both. Send the warden a letter. Yep. Okay. Warden. Then also address the warden in the letter. Boom. Got it. All right. Two letters being written today. You might as well book your plane ticket to go down there now. <laughs> this is yeah. for sure going to be allowed. This is going to this is going to help me get on the Find list. Find out some of her favorite things. Oh, see if the you can warden? research the warden. Mm -hmm. Maybe we can send her a gift basket, mm -hmm. some of her favorite stuff. Yeah. Good idea. Now we're talking. Mm -hmm. Yeah. When we come back from vacation, see if you can do a little deep dive and find out what the warden likes. Okay. We'll treat her. Maybe the warden will put you on the list. Yeah, There's also blackmail. Mm. What? what? Wait, no. It's, it's about the 